After years of buzz about the most powerful launch system ever developed, a rocket meant to bridge exploration back to the moon and ultimately Mars, SpaceX's Starship is officially all systems go. With the FAA signing off on final approval Friday, a launch license, the critical and last hurdle for the unmanned orbital test flight to take off. That could be as early as 7 a.m. Central Time tomorrow from SpaceX's South Texas facilities. Founder and CEO Elon Musk tweeting shortly after the news, success maybe, excitement guaranteed. Life can't just be about solving problems. They have to be things that inspire you. Starship has been top of mind for Musk for about a decade, with his stated goal to be able to carry up to 100 people on long-duration interplanetary flights. Back in February of 2021, he sat down with our Tom Costello. You know, the, the reason I'm doing this is not so that I can get to Mars, but so that uh, humanity can get to Mars. The company spent years conducting high-altitude test flights, some of which included dramatic explosions as SpaceX worked on its landings, a successful suborbital test in 2021, and previous regulatory challenges. But now, the FAA noting in a statement, SpaceX met all safety, environmental, policy, payload, airspace integration, and financial responsibility requirements. NASA's already awarded the company contracts worth more than $3 billion as part of the space agency's Artemis program. Still, the end goal for SpaceX remains sending people to Mars. And come Monday, it may be one step closer. Sam Brock, NBC News. We will be watching. Sam, thanks very much. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.